Hey everyone! Guess what? I finished my Breeding Out the Ugly Challenge. I'll show you which sims I started with and how many generations it took me to get good looking sims. Uh, keep in mind I always try to find an attractive sim to woohoo with, so this may have taken a little quicker than most of the Breed Out the Ugly challenges. Alright, let's take a look here. So first I have um, Duncan and Priscilla Donut. These two lovely looking people. Um, their voices are reversed. I'll try to play it for you. Um, which means that, just for the extra challenge, um, Duncan has the female voice, and Priscilla has the male one. They both have, um, pointed chins, uh, that protrudes past their, uh, noses, which are also very large and almost hawk-beak-like. <laughs> Oh, and, um, yes, Duncan and Priscilla eventually had a girl who is this <laughs> lady who's wanting to get into the camera. Uh, her name is Lou, who also has that very protruding chin. Um, she eventually found a mate and had a son, Jason, who actually, Jason got rid of that large nose, but he still has that big, huge chin. Um, almost seems more chiseled, almost like, like a weapon or something. But anyway, so, um... Here comes the better looking ones. My viewers on Twitch said that this guy actually, he looked fine. Um, but the only thing that I found about him was that his irises were really, really small. So just to be sure that the genetics were as far away from the originals as possible, I bred him again, and I got him a pretty cute looking guy. So, I mean, he looks a little better, right? I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Um, if you decide you want to tweak uh, Duncan or Priscilla, or just want to try your own Breed Out the Ugly challenge, I've put them on the Sims gallery, and um, I actually left them undressed and without hair, so you can decide the hairstyles, if any, and the clothes. Um, my name is the same as it is on YouTube or Twitch. It's Zaretta. Z-A-R-R-E-T-A. But that's it. Tell me what you think.